My name is George Abraham Pachail. George, how did you get into politics? What, what are you doing now? What is your position with the party? I am working with the uh, Indian Youth Congress as an observer, like a, a member on the National Office Bearer team. It's, we call it as a National Office Bearer pool. I am working in that. I got selected to the, that NOB pool and now working with Youth Congress as a volunteer. And what's been your association with Youth Congress? How long have you been there? What post have you been there so far? I have an uh, NSVY background and I came into uh, Youth Congress as a member in 2004. And in 2005, uh, I got in the nominate, nomination system, I got nominated as a district general secretary of my home district, Patanandata. And when the election, uh, that continued for uh, uh, three terms, uh, I was uh, district general secretary. In the election system, I got elected as the Lok Sabha general secretary of uh, my Lok Sabha, Patanandata Lok Sabha. And from there, when the national office bearers election came from the uh, elected office bearers, uh, I got selected into this NOB pool. And now, what what are your responsibilities as a member of the NOB What are you looking after as a specific? Yes. Uh, uh, since uh, uh, November 2011, I am working with the uh, Youth Congress, Indian Youth Congress team with the unit management. We have a system of unit management that we were introdu we introduced as a, as a pilot project in Goa. Uh, I got a chance to associate with that unit management team. And since then, I am working in the IYC as in the Nobi pool. And now it is in a more uh, more reformed state, uh, more in a in a cha final stage uh, unit management. Now we, it is introduced in almost uh, 11 states in India. Now I am uh, working with that, uh, continuing with that uh, unit management team as my functional responsibility, and I have a territorial responsibility is also given to me that is of Gulbarga in Karnataka. Right. So tell us about the unit management. What, 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 what is interesting about it? What, what is it? This is the one among the tools of uh, transforming uh, youth congress. So there are uh, seven uh, pillars and associated tools are there. Uh, the, the object behind this is that a, a leader who is selected or a member youth congress office bearer who is selected into, an uh, into a post that doesn't mean that he is a good leader or a committed leader. So youth, uh, we want to, uh, the IYC want to keep on monitoring the performance of the elected office bearers and to find out the best among them and uh, the, the most potential leaders we have to find them. So this is the system, In two things, one we have to monitor them and the second thing we have to inspire our units uh, to keep on working. Uh, that's the unit management system. There are uh, certain tools which uh, it's uh, introduced. Uh, you, every the review meetings of the works are done in every uh, month in, of every unit. So on the basis of that, we keep on monitoring the best workers, the best units, the outstanding members, and at the same time we inspire our units to keep on working with the people. Also we assess. Uh, whenever a program is conducted, what was the impact, what impact it created among the people, what contact the unit is uh, keeping with the people. These all things are involved many, uh, even though it's a, it's, a, it's a simple tool, it's having magnificent many faces. It seems like a scheme which has a lot of potential to identify yes. and evaluate, yes. evaluate young leaders. Yes, yes. It's, yes, it starts from the, the low, the grassroots level to the IVC level. And, and what, what has been your experience with IVC? Like, tell, has there been any interesting thing that you want to tell us? Anything that you can think of? Any, any? I'm a newcomer in the IVC team, the national team. No, but I mean, yeah. you've been with IVC for a long time, so it need not be about the national team. Okay. It can be anything about from your home area or anything, anything. Anything yes, you've yes. heard of, anything you'd like to share with us. Yeah. Uh, of course, I was a member of the, the earlier system and I am a member of the new system. So I, can, I think I can make a comparison of this. The Youth Congress, I am from a state, the Kerala, as you know, it's a politically vibrant state. 
And the earlier committee was a nominated committee uh, which include all the members who are want to become an office bearer. The doors were open and we lived like a family. We enjoyed the political work, the political work culture we had, we enjoyed it. We, uh, we made many struggles, many strikes, even we were in jails. So it was, it was, it was like a family. Yes, in, in uh, political uh, attacks, we, in Kerala we were, we were fighting with, the, we have to fight with the, the communist people and the police at the same time. So, in both the cases, in, even if we fight with the DYFA people or the, uh, the attack is with the police, we used to, we have to be in jail. That was, uh, that is, it, was it was not, it was nothing, uh, a shameful thing, that was a credit, like a warrior, the wounds of a warrior. To say that we were, we had been to jail for a political cause, uh, like that. So we enjoyed that. Uh, what was the first? Uh, do, you, do you remember? Do you remember issue over which? Do you remember an agitation which was interesting, which sort of you guys you guys involved? I can give you uh, the the the, uh, the Marxist Communist Party when they were ruling. Uh, there was an attempt to uh, to uh, deteriorate, to degrade or. Uh, adding some elements uh, regarding the uh, international movement in the textbooks uh, to something which is not true and uh, sometimes defamatory and also uh, the, uh, there was a, there was an attempt uh, to, to to make the entire curriculum or textbooks uh, with unwanted things so there was a very wide protest throughout the state which was uh, organized by the uh, Kerala Pradesh Youth Congress Committee. We were all actively participated in that strike. It was like that. That's one, one instance. There are many instances. Why, why, why? Then for the police attacks are not, uh, it's, a, it's a very common thing. Once if, if an attack is on one place, there will be repercussions, there will be waves of uh, protest throughout the state of Kerala. That is the system we have, uh, have there. In the election system, uh, the change that came, it, the doors are open to any, uh, all persons who are interested to become a member of Youth Congress, the doors got opened. And the uh, election, with the coming of election, uh, after the member, open membership, the leaders were selected through the process of election. When they, as an elected body, we feel more, uh, uh, what we call more value among the people, the number is limited, number of office bearers is limited and we feel ourselves that we came into the system and we got elected and we are office bearers because of the voters who vote for us. And also we feel ourselves more responsible to the party and the organization also. That's a, even now when I am in the IYC team, I feel the same uh, uh, pride.